Hi, I'm Glenn Martin with the WorkSource Career Center here in Austin, Texas. I'm here to talk to you about a very common thing that we have as we're doing our job search and as we're looking for jobs. As you well know that the whole idea of looking for a job is to find a job where you work less and get paid more. Today, I'm going to talk with you a little bit about resumes and cover letters. As you're already fully aware, that the purpose behind all of these classes that we teach here are not just to give you some information, but it's to be able to help you, to be able to take you to the next level, because the whole idea is to get to a place where that you work less and get paid more. So we're going to give you the tools that you need to have in order to process through these things. You talk about resumes. What is the purpose behind a resume? The purpose behind a resume is not to get you a job. The purpose behind a resume is to get you the interview. So that once you have that interview, then you can talk to them about a relationship that you can form with them. The other purpose behind having a resume is that it can list your skills, your qualifications, and your education in previous work history. So then at that point, you can be able to talk more about those things. A resume basically is just like a, it's a mini-me, It's what it comes down to. A resume, on another term we'd like to call it, is like your sales brochure. You have your company that we'll call Me Incorporated. As for me, it would be Glenn Incorporated. I have a certain skill set. I have certain abilities. I have an education to be able to do a certain job. Whenever you present your resume, you've got just a short period of time to be able to talk to that prospective employer or that human resource director or manager to tell them the skills and the education that you have to do the job. Whenever they look at that resume, one of the things that we have found out, being in this position for a number of years, one of the things that we've found is that an, a human resource director, a manager, an owner of a business, a department head, will spend somewhere between 7 and 15 seconds to determine if he wants to hire you. What will he do during that 7 to 15 seconds? That employer will determine who you are. Are you accessible? What is the job you want? And are you qualified to do that job? How long is 7 to 15 seconds? It's as long as it takes me to say who you are. Are you accessible? What is the job you want, and are you qualified for that job? We're going to talk about these things, about what makes for a good resume, in the next few minutes.